don't like the look on your face. What's the problem? I don't know the last time you talked to your husband, my brother. What's with him? I had a terrible dream. I had a dream where he was paralyzed. The next thing he died. Isama refused to be crowned king. And Ono who said the kingship has gone to another family. I don't understand what all that means. That's a that's a bad omen. It's a direct message. Call him on the phone and tell him to come back to Nigeria immediately. My love, you just have to come back to Nigeria. Listen, from the revelations and happenstances around, month end may just be too far. You know something I don't like about you? You don't know when one is playing and when one is serious. Listen, my love, you have a lot of things to take care of here. Your sister had a dream about you, and that dream wasn't fantastic. It must be presented to Dibiafa to dissect for you. You are a king, and you do not believe in dreams? What do we call that? My love, you have a lot of things to take care of in Nigeria. You just want to sit back in Paris? Do you remember telling me that you saw your mother in a dream? And in that dream, she told you that she wasn't happy with you? Good. Now, your sister has a similar dream. It is not a joke, my love. Oh, is it okay? Let us not argue over this. I will be expecting you, my love. Lord, what if I is? Please take it away. Hello, babe. Yeah, I'm already I'm already late for work. You know, you know it's my first day. I don't want to mess up things. See, just you know what will happen? I will call you once I get to the office and settle down, right? I'll call you, I'll call you, please. Alright, bye. Love you. <laughs> hey babe. How are you? What kind of game are you playing with me this morning? You are that one woman that means the entire world to me. Can you stop this? I'm already late for work and we're standing outside. It doesn't matter. I am not stopping you from going to work, okay? But I needed to do this before the sun rises this morning. Will you marry me? Be my wife? What? You know exactly what this means, okay? You know, recently something came up to separate us. But God allowed us to stay intact and that is why I want to seal it up now so that we'll be happy forever. It just, it just melted my heart. I love you so much. Is that, is that a yes? <laughs> Thank you. Come on. You're welcome. Mm, I love you so much. Welcome to the palace. 
Thank you, Your Majesty. I was told that uh, you're all here while I was out of the country. Yes, Your uh, I'm back now. The trip was unavoidable. <laughs> uh, so you have my ears. Uh, let's talk. What brings you to the palace? Thanks for the audience, Your Majesty. Oh, that's fine. Uh, go ahead. Talk to me. This man seated here is evil. He has done everything with his evil powers to truncate progress in our family and even kill those who are not lucky enough. These are very weighty allegations and it's coming from a family member. Is there an element of truth to what I have just heard? Uh, uh, you see, Your Majesty, <clears throat> ordinarily, I would not want to give honor to a lie with a reply. But uh, coming to your presence, uh, I have to say something. Uh, it's a revered presence. You see, I do not know the prophet or seer that's feeding them with these stupid notions about me. I'm a very progressive-minded person. I love to see my people progress, uh, see the light. Uh, but uh, in fact, I do not understand what they're talking about, Your Majesty. Don't listen to him, Your Majesty. Actually, we are here that he may prove his innocence by swearing on the ancient staff, the sacred of four of kings of Okwe. Oh. <clears throat> I hope you know that any guilty person who swears by the secret staff of Ogwe Kingdom dies. And sometimes it happens within 24 hours. Why would you want such fate to befall a member of your family? Your Majesty, please, let me swear. I am ready to swear. You see, I know the, 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 therefore, that ancient institution on its own does not kill an innocent person. It does not. My hands are clean. I want to swear, Your Majesty. I am ready for it. Please. He is playing a mind game with you, Your Majesty. Don't listen to him. You may have survived other charms. You are not going to survive this one. The ancient Tofo sacred staff of kings of Okwe. Its power comes direct from the gods through a journey. You can't survive this. It's your time to die. Very well then. I'll be back. Okay.
I am afraid you will all have to go and return on a Kemaket day. Why, Your Majesty? That is when I have the permission to to use the offer. It's alright, Your Majesty. I will go and come back. What is the meaning of this? How do I begin to explain that I cannot find the sacred staff of my ancestors? What is going on? Is it just a test of other forms? What happened? The king has discovered that the Asian staff is missing. What? How? You know, he only makes use of it once in a while. And then all of a sudden something came up and, and he needed to, to use it. He went there and it wasn't there. I didn't know he was going to find out so fast. Me neither. Me neither. Then you need to leave that place immediately. You, you need to leave the palace immediately. Huh? Are you kidding me? Of course. Th there is no other way. That's what I decided to do. I have to go. Meanwhile, um, Mirabel, thank you for the advice you gave me. It's okay. We need to get you out of there ASAP. Yes. Hey, hey baby. How are you? Fine, thank you. Welcome. Thank you. Should I ask them to make you tea or coffee? No, thank you. I'm fine. Or rum? Bring you rum. <laughs> it's too early. I know it's too early. <laughs> okay, so you said you wanted to see me. Yes. Alright, talk to me. <sighs> Nazar, I've thought about this and I have come to the conclusion that it's only right that you marry the king. <laughs> Maribel, uh, look, I don't, I don't know where this is coming from, but you know my stand on this. I can't do it. Apart from the flimsy excuse you've been given, what other reason is preventing you from marrying the king? I actually have a very good excuse, and you know that. I have a man in my life. His name is Emeka, and you know how much I love him. Sweetheart, I'm not talking about you leaving Emeka for the king. I know that you love Emeka very well. So what are you talking about? I'm talking about you enriching yourself, and then you walk away at the end. I don't understand. Okay, here it is. The Asian staff of the kings of Okwe, from what I have gathered, is worth over 3 million euros. It is a symbol of authority that is believed to be over a thousand years. Okay. <laughs> I do not know what business I have with this information. Mary, but we're talking about my love life here. You're talking to me about some ancient... what? What? Chinazo, Chinazo, stop thinking like a fool. You and I know that there's no way that love has put food on the table. I'm talking about the Asian staff. That's because I already have a standby buyer. So all you have to do is find your way into the palace, all in the name of marrying the king. Find the Asian staff, bring it to me. I will sell it. You and I will be three million euros richer. Do you get it? all the money I've been spending on them. 
they don't know that it's proceeds from the sale of their ancient stuff. That's the price the king has to pay for not halting when he was advised to. I guess. Ha! Don't marry Bell. I won't lie to you. Honestly. That man is so sweet. So romantic. It's just... He's sweet. You know, sometimes I just wish I could have that forever. <laughs> Jonathan, do not be a fool. You and I know that you cannot have him. You went into the palace for a deal. Now that the deal is sealed, and they are beginning to search for the missing staff, it's high time you left there before they start tracing it to you. You got it? The man is sweet. You will want, but you do not want to listen Because of pleasure, because of lust Now look at you, see where you are now Your world is changing, you don't know what to do Look at you, see where you are now Oh no, we could look at you what a good man. Are you confirming to me that Onowu is responsible for the disappearance of Ofo? Of Ogwe? You've been stubborn. You've been strong ahead of you abandoned what's of wisdom No matter who you are No matter where you're from You always need advice from people Cause a tree can never make a forest Nobody knows it all A tree can never be a forest what did Ono tell you concerning the investigation about the woman now? Your Majesty, as you have made up your mind to marry this lady, I feel you should take a step further by engaging the services of Dibiafa. Why do I need to engage the service of Dibiafa? For him to tell me that the beautiful woman I saw is no longer beautiful. Your Majesty, it is not all about beauty. It is deeper than that. This woman is going to be married to the king. A situation that will expose her to lots and lots of royal dynamics. Biafra is needed to look into her spiritual being and tell us if her spirit connects with your spirit in any way. Oh no, I'd like to put an end to this meeting because it's taking us. This is not why I invited you here. I'm getting married to a physical being and not her spirit. I invited you here because I need you to set machineries in motion because you're going to be the one to lead other men in council to her place for her bride price. That is what we should be talking about. Are you saying you are not even bothered with the fact that other known men have gone down with this lady? Why should I be bothered with details like that? Your Majesty, a woman who is to be married to the king is like a goddess, a sacred authority. 
if it can be proven that other men may have enjoyed her as a woman, then she's no longer good for the king. Oh no, well, this is not 1926. This is the 21st century. I would not reduce myself to that kind of reasoning and judgment. I don't live in the past. I'm here now. I have a family. I have a daughter who is of age and I'm certain that she has a boyfriend. And I'm also certain that she might have been sexually involved in her boyfriend out of passion and a great desire to engage with her man. What am I going to do? Throw my daughter away? Tell me. Oh no. What a young lady does before she meets her husband stays in the past. I not her husband's business. Huh? Whatever Chinazo has done with other men, I do not know about. I did not witness. I do not want to know. I am dealing with the woman of today. The one that I interface with. The one that has shown me so much love and so much care. And I want to make her my second wife. Although I believe that I have made my point. Get the other elders together. Let us forge ahead. I am disappointed in you. Look at you! You got married to the daughter of the sun so you can pray to Ajani. Now tell me, have you ever prayed to this Ajani for once? You have disappointed this family, Ikena. And I will never forgive you. Odera, it hasn't gotten to the point where you address my husband, your brother, the king, by his name. He is still... Oh, please. He is Ikena and nothing else. Oh. My name is Zach Orji, and I'd like to encourage you to watch quality Nollywood movies on Sony Reaching Nolly TV. My name is Frederick. My name is you. You, Edoche. Go and subscribe to Sony Reaching Nolly TV.